Okay, we were asked what is the pressure exerted by this fluid at the base of the jar. Um, this is as good as asking us what is the fluid pressure at the depth of 20 cm. Fluid pressure is given by this formula H rho G. So fluid pressure is um, H is the vertical depth. So the vertical depth is uh, 20 cm converted to meters will be 0.2. Density of the fluid uh, of this liquid we are told is 600 kg per meter cube and of course G is 9.81 and this will give us the answer 1180 Pascal. Um, many students will ask uh, why can't we take the weight of the liquid divided by the base area. Um, the uh, a quick answer to this will be uh, we can't do that because um, the amount of force that's acting on the base is not just the weight of the liquid the flask is also exerting a contact force you might say a normal contact force onto the liquid so this force has a vertical downward component so that will add to the amount of force that's acting at the base here so it's safer if you just stick to the formula and just look for the uh, vertical depth. In fact, um, this formula is quite cool. It doesn't matter what the shape of the container is. It could easily have been like this. Right? Uh, you can even think of some very exotic shape. It could even be like this. So regardless of the shape, if you are asked what is the fluid pressure at a particular depth, just see how far, how deep below the surface of the liquid it is. Alright, and apply this formula and you get the answer.